my favorite piece of advice was to not always jump in and answer all the questions in important meetings. Toughen up, because it's not going to be an easy journey. Give the younger creatives or just the young people in the room a chance. In this industry, in order to really get to the top, you really need to learn resilience. You need to know how to take failures and not consider them failures, but actually opportunities or pauses for you to reflect, to re-energize and jump back in. And they actually get an opportunity to speak for themselves and practice selling their own work and leading and owning the room. Focus on the work was to make sure that I was nurturing my talent that I was training myself up every three to six months. Trusting myself and uh, finding out, focusing on finding out what, was, what I was strong about. To not depend wholeheartedly on people, but more so on my skill set, because people can be fickle. The industry is like a wave. It goes up and down, left, right, it moves a lot. But if you are steadily growing your skill set, then you don't have to worry too much about whether you're going to have a job or a client. One of the things I always tell to young creatives is to make sure that they learn how to sell the work, not just do great work. Elevate each other, grow as a, as a group, because we are very accustomed to being in conversations where it's like all the man and a girl, all the man and a girl. Good ideas don't sell themselves. You need to really become so good at selling uh, your work. Practice, presenting, speak up. Building their personal brand as professionals in, in the creative industry, I think it's also really important because you need to have everything on your side to win. Have your voice heard, advocate for yourself because nobody will advocate as hard as you will for yourself. Build their personal brand without oversharing. The most important thing is not to be overwhelmed. The most important thing is to really believe in yourself. I think every single woman and maybe men as well go through the imposter syndrome. We all have those moments where we wonder, are we really good or are we just here because we're here? Share a little bit of your personal life, but more so share your personal journey and the process while you're going through it. Believe in yourself and do not get sidelined by anything else. Just stay true to your beliefs, your focus, and you will get there and you will shine.